Hey guys, so shortly I'm gonna have a video coming out talking about this Rifab windshield, but I just wanna talk about a, a couple of things. Um, number one, over at Harbor Freight, I got these, uh, these car dollies, uh, just so I could move things around and have easier access when I'm working out here. And uh, they were on sale for like 40 bucks for a pair, so 80 bucks for the set. And um, number one, I'm actually really pleased with them. It's nice, thick steel diamond plate. Uh, all you do is uh, put the wheels on. And I will say, of course, you know, the wheels are not the greatest quality, but uh, the diamond plate, no complaints. Um, another thing that uh, came up is in another video, I was talking about what I was, uh, what I was doing over here. I got that done, got my um, relocated USB port moved and um, got the new um, when I've had it for months, but I got the new um, center cup there put in, and uh, so that's all done. Um, next up is the windshield and then the, the, the windshield washer. But one of the things that um, I wanted to talk about, because I'm sure the question will come up, is why, why am I switching windshields? Well, I like the Super ATB windshield. Actually, it's really good quality. Um, to their credit, it's that hard polycarbonate, but um, one of the complaints I have about it is it is a little difficult. I did try working with a windshield washer on, or a windshield wiper on it. Never quite got it to work the way I wanted it to. Um, I think this one, the Rifab on the glass, will work a lot better, um, be a lot easier to see. The other thing that I, I like about the Rifab is that it folds down instead of the Super ATV, which folds up. And uh, until you, uh, and I'm sure some of you, plenty of you out there don't have windshields, um, but if you have the flip up windshield, one of the, uh, not really headaches, but one of the, the things that of course you notice is that um, with the flip up windshield, you do lose some of the upper end visibility. And if you're tall, like I am, I'm about six foot three. If you're tall, then that can make a difference, especially if you're approaching a slope and you, you want to see really well. So that's a little bit of a complaint. Um, to Super ATV's credit, again, their, their windshield, good quality. Uh, I've been really, really pleased with it. I would certainly buy it again, just depending on the application. Um, I'm actually selling it to a guy. I'm supposed to come pick it up tomorrow, but um, that's why I'm, I'm switching. The, the windshield, the Rifab windshield, of course, is more, but it does have actual glass. Um, I believe it's actually laminated uh, DOT type glass for windshields. And um, if, if it were to break or crack, that should be relatively easy to fix uh, at a local glass shop since it's just a flat piece um, and look, probably actually a little bit easier to source than the, the polycarbonate because uh, I do know a, a local glass shop. I am going to be taking my windshield wiper. Um, I've got that here. And what I'm going to be doing is on this type of windshield, having this hook at the end of the line here is, is not desirable. Um, we actually want to get rid of that and I need to shorten this up by about a total of five inches anyway. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to cut this off right here on my score line and then this is going to be this new end here. So I'm going to basically wrap this around and then I have, I think this one was a, um, I think this is like a 16 inch and then this is a 12 inch. Um, the 12 inches. I think the better fit, but uh, but I'll try both of them and see what happens. So I've got that coming up as well. So lots of material in the works. It's gonna take me a while to get all this stuff done, um, but I really just wanna kinda of address the question of why switch to the Rifab. Um, I, I'm really looking forward to getting it on there. Uh, the Rifab has, when, when it is in the up position, it has a lower vent that kicks out, and the reviews online say it, it really brings in a lot of air which I'm kind of looking forward to testing out. So that's, uh, that's what's going on. Stay tuned for more. For, uh, for everyone that, that is subscribed, thank you very much. If you have not subscribed, please subscribe to the channel. It really helps me out and I really do appreciate it. And uh, stay tuned for more content.